working closely with us when we were in the process of bargaining and voting on a tentative agreement this week. And I don't know if you've heard the term of bargaining in good faith, but you make these announcements in the week that we're voting on our collective agreement that you're going to privatize kitchen, you're going to privatize housekeeping, you're cutting the laundries, merging the laundries. That's that not bargaining in good faith. Well, I, I can right. tell you uh, that, uh, that we have from square one. We'll continue going forward uh, to uh, deal uh, and work with you in good faith. We're committed to that. We have been in the past. We're going with you. Yeah, well, like your, your MLAs from this region told us when the ALC units come here that it wasn't going to affect patient care. We have patients laying on stretchers for five days and emerge now That's right. because we have no critical care, acute care beds. We've lost 40-some beds to ALC units. Your yeah, plan sucks. We have to be listened to.